level at the time in the fourth to pad the lead felt extremely big. Did it feel that way to you? Yeah, it did. It did. Obviously, I was fired up. But, but again, every big hit, um, you know, every pitch in the postseason is so important. I thought guys did a great job of grinding out at out bats. Obviously, Glaber hitting in front of me. I think he was on base all five times tonight. And, um, you know, just being able to being able to get in good counts and take good swings, lay off some tough pitches, and um, you know, top to bottom, I thought it was a great um, group effort. When did you find out that that Aaron Boone was going with you in left field tonight? And did you expect to be out there game one? Yeah, I always expect to be out there. Always, um, always prepare as if I'm going to be out there. I had a good idea um, last night before I went to bed that I would be in there. So. Again, just um, you know, always prepared, always, always, um, you know, no matter whatever my role is, be ready. And um, you know, obviously excited about being in the lineup, excited about some of the swings I took tonight. And um, you know, it's important for us to come out and do the same thing again tomorrow. We'll take the next one from Bob Clappish. Bob, please unmute. Carter, considering the way you guys have played up until tonight, uh, you yourself said you were you were not pleased with the way things were going. Did you sense in any way that this uh, this breakout was coming before the game? Did you sense something different? I had a good feeling about it. I, th I think all the guys in the in, in that room, um, you know, had a good feeling about today and a good feeling about where we were at, and um, you know, just being able to being able to flip the switch. You know, after Sunday, after the regular season was over, um, you know, try and flip that switch and really just focus on today. Take things one day at a time and. Um, yeah, had a good had a good idea that, that we would come out tonight and, and be able to get Garrett a lead. Obviously, um, you know we scored quite a few runs. I don't think you ever expect that against a pitcher as um, the caliber of, of Shane Bieber. But um, again, I thought that collectively we put some really good at bats together. And um, you know, anytime you're able to get your ace um, a couple runs early and give him some room to work with, I thought he did a great job, Garrett, of, of just getting ahead, you know, commanding the zone and really, um, you know, making it tough on their hitters. So just overall, a fun game to be a part of. We'll take the next one from Bruce Beck. Uh, just a reminder, everyone, we have Glaber waiting outside, so we're going to try and uh, speak to Brett quickly. Go ahead, Bruce. Uh, Guardy, does a game like this, can it impact and serve as a springboard, do you think, for, for the entire postseason? Yeah, sure. I mean, I think that's definitely the hope, obviously. You know, the last few weeks, not happy about the way that we finished the regular season, so... You know, our season started today, and, um, you know, these games in October, um, I guess we're not in October yet, but these playoff games are so important, every pitch, every at-bat. And, um, you know, I thought that our focus, our level of focus up and down the lineup tonight was very good um, against some really, really tough pitching. And, um, you know, hopefully um, that's a sign of more good things to come here over the next three or four weeks.